Hi, this is Mrs Sykes and today we're going to have a look at transects. So this is one of the ways that we can do field work outside, having a look at what types of plants are around. Now we normally would do a transect when we were asking a very specific question. A transect is about a where question or how far away. How far away from the beach will you start getting plant life? How far away from the factories is it worthwhile growing your crops? How far away from the river will these animals be able to survive because the plants they need to eat are still there? It's a distance thing. And because it's a distance thing, you will always have, in some way or other, a tape measure involved when we're looking at transects because it's a how far away thing. You'll also be using a frame quadrat. So this is called a quadrat. And a quadrat is a grid, four by four grid, sometimes with little squares in between. You might have seen something that looks a little bit like this if you've actually done this in real lessons. They tend to be about 50 centimetres square. And you put them on the ground to see how many plants are in an area and which plants are in an area. So I've got a little cheating one here. So if I put my quadrat here, I would have this type of plant in it and there would only be one. So quadrats are used to find out which plants are there and how many of them. If my, my quadrat had been placed here, there are two plants in it. So I'd have to identify this type of plant and say there was one of them and this type of plant and say there was one of them. So quadrats are used for placing on the ground and then instead of counting every single plant that's available in an area, you only count the ones inside the quadrat. You identify which one they are. So is it grass? Is it clover? Is it a dandelion? And how many of them are? So count and which ones have I got? Here I've got some reed grass. And there's only one of them. Here I've got some clover, here I've got something that's more kind of harrow grass. How many are there? Which one is it? A transect is always about how far away something happens. You probably have come across this sort of thing in your lessons. So you would have a feature, in this case we're looking at a tree, and then you have a tape measure going off into the distance. And it's the tape measure itself that is the transect. Now I'm representing this with a pen line because it's much easier to do while I'm doing my little video. But don't forget, for all intensive purposes, out in the real world, you would have a tape measure like this and it would go off into the distance. And at every metre, or every two metres, you would put down your quadrant. So this is our tree and we are heading off into the distance to see how far away we need to travel in order to answer our question. How far away from the tree will the flowers survive? So we would put our quadrat down right next to the tree at zero metres and we would count to see what species of plants we had found and how many there were and we'd write it down. Then we would move to two metres. Same quadrat, picked up, put back down again. And we identify what plants we've got inside it, we count them, and we write it down. Then we would move to four metres. And at four metres, we would identify the types of plant, how many there were, and write it down. And then we would move it along again, do six metres. Which plants, how many, write it down. And then at eight metres, which plants, count how many of each there are, and write it down. And what this would tell us is, from the numbers we've got, that there is no point planting plants here, because they're too close to the, to the tree, they don't get enough sunlight, they don't get enough water or mineral ions from the soil. But at about four metres, for example, it's okay to plant any of the new plants you want to plant, they will grow nicely. And we would know that from here onwards would be worthwhile. 
because a transect is about measuring plants and how far away things are. So if you ever come across an exam question and if you're not sure if it's a transect or not, you're looking for something in the question to be to do with distance or the results table that you've been given is done at distances, two metres, four metres, six metres away. 